Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. Today we are doing something we have never done on this channel. Today we are doing something we've never done before in our entire lives. Today we are gonna find out what the heck actually happened to Stella to get her that scar. At least hopefully we're gonna find that out. Today is all about discovery and figuring out and learning more about our horses. Are you excited? Yeah, but Gabby's using a horse that she shouldn't be. Oh my it's gosh. Mine. Oh my gosh. Mine. We are a sharing family. So what horses are we going to find out about today? Finn and Stella. Finn and Stella, because we already know everything about Storm. Okay, Gracie's like, you're taking me. If you're taking her, you're taking me. Okay, Gracie, you can't come. You can't come. She's like, I am coming. <laughs> you can't come, Gracie girl. You need to actually come in here. All right, so she's, Gabby's gonna let me be the getting rid of oh gosh this could get bad you stay here i know i'm not trying to be mean to you but get away from the gate Ooh, stella stella's kind of gassy i promise one day we'll do this for you too but i pretty much know about your past i pretty much know everything about you and not very much about you you guys have been eating too much you're getting chubby again they're like, listen, this is getting crazy. Stop taking away our girl. They go right to the fence. They're like, I can see her. Wow, I need to clean up your paddock. Look at your fur. Oh, those are raindrops. Gracie, I've been telling everybody how amazing you are. She's like, well, I'm not amazing today because you're taking away my girl. They're bringing in Finn, oh, and they're bringing in Storm because you guys gotta get cleaned up. Where we're going, it's like a fancy thing. It's not like a riding thing. We will not be riding, but you gotta get cleaned up. excited um the horses saw sam getting the trailer ready and then got excited anyway uh somebody sent us this canter coat shine i don't remember exactly who i have a guess but i don't want to guess wrong um and i used it on her i used it on her what do you guys think like i see a huge difference it's not super wet it just goes on over top of like on their coat and i'm gonna use it on look at the bugs though i'm gonna spray you i'm gonna use it on Finn too. I always let Stella, I always let Stella smell every single thing that I have because, because smell. Okay, hurry up. It's in our tack trunk because smelling is one of the ways that horses access their world, right? So one of the nice things that I do for Stella is always let her smell every single thing. It's like, it's like such an amazing thing for horses to be able to smell things. So I'm walking Stella out up to the trailer and she's literally dragging me to the to the field. She's like, let's go there again. <laughs> but we're not. Stella. Dude. I mean, pretty girl. <laughs> she's like, I want to go there. Literally, this horse talks. She literally just told me, well, what about Finn? As we got closer to the trailer, she's like, what about my friend? What about my friend? And I'm like, yeah, I stopped her. And I'm like, yeah, he's coming. And literally, she just got so calm. Like, she trusts us. Storm's probably gonna be upset. All right, we are loaded. We loaded Finn first. And Stella likes to just hop on after another horse is up there. Storm. Well, she doesn't get to have that choice. Right, but today is not the day for the battle of the will of Stella. Today is the day we're going to find out how the heck you got that scar, Stella. And Finn, we're going to see what your life was like before we got you. Alright, so here's the trouble. 
Gabby, I don't have a horse here, so I'm I'm handling the fifty. Yeah, Gabby. Well, when things in the class has, I'm holding. Gabby didn't bring a horse, so we all have to do our own work, and it sucks. You originally had to do your own work. I know, but usually you do you, when you don't bring a horse, you do my work for me. No, we have a puppy. Gabby's choosing a puppy over Stella. People want to know: Are you gonna still ride Stella sometimes? Yes. Yeah, man. Okay. So Finn's supposed to get off before Stella. Nope, Stella. People are saying that the heaviest horse gets off. Nope. Laugh. Nope. Yeah, I believe you, Gabby, actually. Ask Fiona. Right, here comes my dog, my horse. You better go because Finn's biting her. <gasps> Do not bite my horse. Uh-oh. Slowly, then. So, okay, and we need to move. So, basically, today we are seeing a psychic, an animal pet psychic. Mom, how do you always get out of doing your own work? Oh, it's a skill, sister. It's a skill. It's because you make that jump. Look at that jump. That's a cool jump. Okay, Mom, I need. That is a super cool jump. Do not run the goat over. Okay, so basically we're here, and uh, it took me a while to figure out what was going on, but we are seeing a woman named Lauren Bode, who is the pet psychic um, in this area that's very popular, and so yeah, there's a goat here, a bunch of Dachshunds, Sophie brought the puppy, but not to be red. <laughs> um, there, hopefully there are going to be some more horses, I'm sure, Texas coming, but anyway, yeah, I'm going to try and video the whole thing, because we need to figure it all out. Are the dogs getting done? Their dogs? What? Are their dogs getting red? Yeah. Oh, and the goat. And the goat. It is a cute goat, though. It's a big goat. It's a big goat. It's beautiful. I'll try and get a picture of the goat. What's the matter, eh? What's the matter? You're not used to being stuck in a stall, huh? But you got your boy there. See Finn? Kaylee's about to. We just saw Kaylee drive by. Yeah. All right. We'll go meet Kaylee. But anyway, it's taken a little bit longer. Like we start in like 10 minutes, and it seems like there's at least three animals still in front of us, and they're 15 minutes uh, time slots. But uh, while we're waiting, comment below, do you believe in pet psychics or you don't believe in pet psychics? Have you been to a pet psychic? Was it accurate? Uh, comment below your experiences and thoughts. Oh, look at you. <laughs> Who's this? This is Stella. Stella, you're lovely. So all the boys Stella? like Stella. Stella's oh, yeah. 13. Listen to the boys. Yeah, hey. the boys are all like, she's like, hey, who are you? They're all doing their wolf whistles. Yeah. <laughs> Boys do like her. Yeah. How old is Stella? Thirteen. She is lovely. Yeah. What's your name? Gabby. Gabby? You like Gabby? <laughs> Gabby, she wants me to tell you she loves you. <laughs> and she said she missed you. Where did you go? She stopped riding her. Yeah. Why? Because she's my horse. And because she's off and she was having a rest. And she has her own horse and it's been show season. She has a stone bruise. Yeah, yeah. She told me all those things already, but she still wants me to ask you where you've been. Why aren't you playing with her or doing whatever? Okay. Yeah. All right. So she wants me to tell you that her body is feeling better. Oh, good. Her back end was hurting quite yeah. a lot. So yes. I think it's because she said it's because she changed her gait. Yes. Okay. Yeah, that's exactly what the chiropractor said. So did you lose a horse? Me? Yeah. Oh. I just sold one. Mm, okay. I, I do, you have a horse here, isn't you? I have a horse here? Oh, she means like in spirit. Yeah. But you know what? Stella loves her. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. That's what I thought she was going to say, that she wants you. <laughs> no, no, that too. But Stella t told me that she lost her horse. She wants to be her horse. You got it? Yeah. I know. Aren't you riding, Stella? Yeah. <laughs> but Stella is kind of like a free spirit. Yes. Stella, Stella That's boarded at my farm. Oh, okay. There but she took care of her. her. Okay. So when we went to look at her, I found, like, we found her and she came back and I 
helped her get better. And there was an instant connection, I feel like, between yeah, the two yeah, of them. Yeah, But you lost a horse at the farm where you were? Or the farmer you have? Yeah. One of them died? Yeah. Don't worry. Yeah, you yeah, think well, about it. A while ago. Mm -hmm. Anyhow. Christmas yeah. Anyhow, your, what's his name? Toby. Toby, okay, yeah. Not mine, he's one of my friends. Yeah, but, but he, 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 he yeah. yeah, well he's with you. Anyhow, Stella is a free spirit. Yeah. And she will be with whom she wants. Yeah, I, I believe that. So we've seen that. It it doesn't diminish her love for you. It just means that Stella could love four or five people at one time. Which she, is she kinda belongs to all of us. Okay, so I just want to Fiona. Tell you that. <laughs> I just want to let you thank know that you. that's how it works. Yeah, right? thank you. I, I believe yeah. that. Yeah, and she wants me to tell you. Thanks. Um, her 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 leg was not good. Huh? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. She had like cramps in her leg. Like she couldn't move. Her pastor was not moving properly. Like it's almost like if she had um this front one here. This this one that yeah. she gave me just now. Yeah. yeah. It's almost like if when she stretched it out, like it would, it would seize up. Yeah. So she could trip. So yeah. She was dangerous to ride, she said. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Yeah. And she also wants to talk about her shoulder that was hurting her very badly. Okay. The shoulder. So she's got a few things going on with her, but nonetheless, she's very brave. Okay. She said she wants to go to shows after she's finished her therapy. She wants to go back to shows because she knows to walk, trot, canter, and she can jump, and she can do all sorts of things. And um, sometimes her stifle hurts her at the back there as well, and her pole hurts her. Oh my God. <laughs> Spoken like a true out. woman. <laughs> yeah. She has a few things going on with her, but it's okay. Um, but I don't know this horse. I don't think she's all horse. I think she's half human. I feel like Sorry. that sometimes too. Thing. Oh, you say the same thing? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I, I just I just want to tell I have to tell you that she's half human. She's not all horse. Yeah? She has a very sane brain. She gets things. She, yeah. Yeah. She She just gets it. Right? She communicates well. She exactly. does. She tells you yeah. everything. Yeah. Yeah. So, um... Be okay, I want <laughs> She is human. She is human. I, I yeah. believe that. Okay. So what are you guys giving her? She needs some stretching exercises. She needs back end exercises. She is feel not feeling the best right now. So she needs some attention. She's her pat her her start her pat her field is not huge right now. She's just the last couple of days we've had her out in a bigger field and she I think she probably does feel the need to run and get out and do stuff. Yeah, yeah. So and because of the restriction she's not feeling well. Yeah? So I um what do you want me to tell her? So she has a scar on her butt and mm -hmm. we don't know where she got that from. It's on the other number side. One. It looks like a number one. It's on the other side there. Oh, it's right here. Right here. Oh, wow. She also has a hawk that's fusing on this side. So we yeah. think that it's connected, but we don't know. Yeah. yeah. That happened before we got yeah, her. This is very deep here. Yeah, very deep. Yeah. Yeah. That's very deep. Wow. Yeah, that is very deep. Okay. Yeah, some idiot did that to her. Yeah. So, but it's okay at least. Yeah, it's, I, she wants me to look at the back all the time there and tell her what it is. I told them. <laughs> okay, yeah. Can she teach kids? Would you like her to do that? Um. She, I don't know. She, she we have two kids. Um, she had, she, she was her horse first, and then she's been riding her. Like we all, she belongs to all of us. Uh, yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah. So she just likes to be a teaching horse, right? Yeah. You want to ride her too? <laughs> <laughs> Look at the puppy. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Yeah. But she enjoys being at the farm. 
and she enjoys all the attention, but she has to be ridden too. Because yes. if she's not ridden, she's going to lose her top line, which she hasn't got much of. Yeah. But she's going to lose what's left of it. Yeah. So this is coming up after Friday. Friday, she's getting some pads put on her feet, and we think yeah. that's going to make a big difference, and then we'll get back to... Okay, good. Can yeah. I tell her that? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Okay, yes, yeah, she's okay with that. Um, what worries me is the, the front leg. It's, um, I don't think that she foundered before. I don't believe so. But I don't like how it's feeling because... She has foundered before. She has? She had her <laughs> yeah, she had very, very 5 to 7% rotation. Very... We, we don't know if she found her before we got her, but then we had her at another barn and, and she was on a round bale and she started to, she had yeah. a founder flare. Yeah, because uh, like I was saying, just how she was giving me the feelings, that's the feelings that they give me when they found her. So yeah, magnesium. So she does get magnesium. She does. And it's made a, a, a world of difference to her. She yeah, yeah. she needed it. It, it. Night and day difference for her. Yeah, yeah, magnesium is very good for her. Will be very good for her to help it, right? Yeah. What would you like me to tell her? You see that don't ride her anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Tell, are you going to ride her again? Yes. Yeah, I think you can't just leave her like that right because she's very sensitive like you can't just ride a horse and then leave the horse yeah right? they uh, last winter she's not a motorbike yeah right? last yeah. winter they <laughs> they started a relationship and and gabby brought her back into being a horse i feel like it, it, they they did they formed it yeah mm -hmm. but then she left her she parked mm -hmm. the motorbike in the stall and gabby is the only one of us that is firm with her and says we're doing this and I think she, she appreciates that. She yeah. helps her have a leader. I think Gabby's the only leader she really has. Yeah, yeah. Except she likes Fiona that. too. <laughs> yeah. yeah. She Trader. likes that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right. I have a question for sure. her because Laura always worries in lessons that she is hurting Stella. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And she doesn't seem to be hurting Stella when she rides, but I'm. could you ask Stella if she's hurting Laura? If Laura's hurting her when she rides her? Or if it was just something that was there previously? No, no, no. She's not hurting her, but Laura is very scared, she said. I don't want to cry. <laughs> <laughs> I am really scared. I don't want to hurt her. See? Yeah. So you're scared. But no, you're not hurting her. You're helping her, actually. I mean, you're not overdoing it. You're not no, a big no. jumper. You're not no. jumping a meter no. So you're not hurting her. Hi, hey, sweetheart. Yeah. You're okay. helping her. Actually. Okay, thank you. That yeah. really helps a lot. Yeah. Welcome. <laughs> <laughs> you never would have asked that. No, I never even thought about it. All right, we have another horse. Dapples. All of our horses have nice dapples right now. So Gabby, she oh loves God. you. Take the bug. Ew. Uh, not to be. Aww, she just loved you. She's like, ride me again. So, some people don't believe in pet psychics or psychics, but she said a lot of things that really affected me. Like she so, said, yeah that really affected her like Stella loves me more than you she does and I felt like crying because she asked I can't remember you guys will have already seen the the footage she said why did you stop riding me to Gabby and I almost started tearing up like I because um, I got a horse and now I'm too busy yeah and like storm wasn't at home Plus so Gabby she's been off yeah but mostly she it's been show season and yeah we got to change that because she also said that she really likes like the kids with the kids riding her and then that broke my heart like she does love kids like one of the girl's friends Shayla was there one day you guys might remember the video and we went on a little trail ride and I was with Sophie and Finn because Finn um, was acting up and I was walking with Sophie and uh, Shayla and Stella just took off like literally they just took off and Stella was like in her glory she was I could tell she was so excited she does love kids so that's something I that, that I didn't right really there. understand before like it was so many things like poor Finn because we always say mean things about him 
We don't even think that he pays attention, but he kept saying he's not an idiot. <laughs> Why do I have to wear the hat? I'm not an idiot. <laughs> yeah, poor boy. I don't know what's happening down there. It makes me nervous. We just got home, and I put Gracie and Willow. Is Willow still behind it? Yeah. Oh, God. Oh. So I guess Gracie can go with Storm. Nobody's going down. How did she get out? She's a hussy, I'm telling you right now. No clue, because Willow can't get out. She must have jumped through. Oh my god, she can jump. She must have jumped. Don't bite her. I do not like that, Finn. Oh my god. What? He's biting her. I'm waiting. All right, so Gracie can go in the field because clearly she's still walking. Okay, so I have no clue how this, how the heck. Like, Storm doesn't let anybody treat him like this. Like, stand that close. What the heck? Oh, he loves. He loves small her. He, he loves, loves small girls. girls. <laughs> Look at I that. Know. That's insane. And she's nine. He's twelve. Yeah. She's, he's too old for you, Gracie. No, he's only three years older. All yeah, right, well, let's go look at them. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.